Having just seen Chronicle, I've decided I've come too far in life without superpowers of my own. So I brought Fergus to the Star Cafe to learn telekinesis. What do you mean it's not real? It's not real. It was in the film and everything. Well, no, that was stunts. It's special. Spe spe well, really? Yeah. Seriously? I can, well, he'll probably teach you some tricks or something. He'll teach me tricks? I'll teach him tricks. Okay, he'll teach me some tricks. Right, let's go. Telekinesis. Yes, you tell. The ability to move, lift, vibrate. <laughs> That's my favorite. <laughs> Spin, bend, break, or impact objects through the direct influence of mental power or other non-physical means. Okay. Sounds familiar. It does sound very familiar. You want to see direct influence? Andrew. <laughs> She's wearing black today. Hi. That's direct influence. <laughs> so, all right, Adam, we've got um, a load of stuff here. Yeah. First thing we're going to start with is a trick with a nut and a bolt. So this is um, a, a telekinetic trick. Okay. So what we need to do first is take this rather hefty magnet and attach it underneath the table. So okay. I'm attach it there. So that's nice and secure there now under okay. the table. And what we've got is a bolt mm -hmm. and a nut. Now, this is rigged with a magnet in the head okay. and the very top is a battery. So what's going to happen is as I place the nut onto the bolt and bring it close to that magnet under the table, what's going to look like it's happening is I'm using my powers to ha, remove and you can stop it if you want or you can carry it on just by playing with that magnetic field yeah. until it comes off the bolt. That's amazing. And of course, then that person you're sitting opposite can have a look to their heart's content and they won't find and anything. It seems like a real nut it and bolt. It does seem like a real nut and bolt. So, next thing we're going to try is a flying £10 note. Fine. That can either be done from, um, from the floor or we can do it so that it comes off the table towards you. Yes, okay. I like that. I like that off the table. Yeah? Yeah. Um, it's a bit easier as well because you, then you've got the flight directly off the table straight into your hand. Gotcha. So that is just working on a flesh coloured device uh -huh. and it's just got a little motor reel yeah. on the inside. So when you click this, this um, attachment here down into your palm, yeah. it retracts that retracts that motor and that thread is attached with a tiny bit of gum. Yeah. So you're going to take that flesh coloured device and yep. we're just going to place it into your middle finger there, right? Maybe just if you have this hand heavy up yeah. and just a little tinkle. There we go, very nice. At this point, so what you've got is a 7-up can uh -huh. with a piece of wire and a fishing hook. Okay. Now, that hook gets attached to a glass that also has wires within the glass. Now, as I turn over and pour, mm -hmm. the line of the water is going to cover the wire travelling down from the can into the glass. Okay. So what you get is an effect that looks like you have a floating glass. That's awesome. So straight up and tip as quickly to that point as possible. Perfect, there we go, can't see a thing. Good stuff. I'm gonna uh, go dazzle some people. Brilliant. Hello. Hi. How are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm doing well. I've got... Yeah. I think I have... I have to talk to you about something. Oh, um, something kind of really weird happened to me last night. Like, what? Um... I don't know, like... I'm kind of freaked out by now. Um, I mean, little things like, like, I mean, you see, like this, I can just. Are you serious? Whip it to my. It's weird. Can you do that with anything? The sides couldn't be enough. It's actually falling apart. Okay. All right, just, just so I know I'm not going crazy. Can you take a look? Take a look at that. I'm scared. 
Uh, me too. Like there? More? That would be fine. That would be fine. Now, it feels like I can just like touch things and, and stuff happens. <laughs> Why are you doing that? And uh, I don't know. I just don't know. <laughs> okay, Maybe uh, you should see a scientist. I have ordered you. I've got you this drink. Um, Thanks. I know you like lemonade, so. <laughs> I, I, I don't know who to tell about it because no one's going to believe me. I don't believe you. Um, I mean. Thank you. Okay, things are really. Really weird stuff's happening, okay? <laughs> Do you just like get out of here? Yeah. Yeah, okay. That could happen. I feel, I feel like you should just leave. Um.